July 29th, 2023. How's it going, guys? Well, I got another video for you. Never fails to amaze me here in Kansas City. People can't read numbers or don't know their ABCs and stuff. Had a prime vehicle pull out in front, which isn't in common because they cross the streets back over here, back and forth, which isn't, like I say, it's not uncommon. Guy comes, starts coming up to the house. Well, we hadn't ordered anything. And uh, just thought that was kind of funny. So uh, he gets up here. He's taking a picture, taking a picture of the address. And uh, I opened the door. I said, hey, buddy. I said, that's not mine. I said, I said, take it. Get off the property. Are you on drugs? No, but maybe this guy from Prime might be. And I'm going to show that. I said, buddy, I said, I got six cameras up in the front of my house alone here with audio. Not good. So I'm going to show a little bit of this. And uh, and then after he got the package, I just, he wouldn't even tell I, I just threw it on the ground out there. Then he went up to the other, was going to go up to his other house where it's not even supposed to go to. I said, you're going, I said, are you an idiot? I said, you got to go down the street. They got this guy. These, you know, these guys supposedly make for 19 to 25 bucks an hour. 19 to 25 bucks an hour, and they can't look at an address on a house? Let's check this out, guys. Hold on. Okay, guys. Now, I'm going to show you. As you see down my circular drive that everybody so much loves, they were parked here. And like I say, you know, it happens all the time. That don't bother me. But what bothers me when they come up on the property, when it's the wrong address, they can't read and they can't count numbers. I'm going to show my address too because uh, my numbers are fully displayed. And this guy making nineteen twenty-five, maybe they should go out and get another prime guy if they, if he can't count numbers. So hold on, guys. Okay, guys. I'm back. And this is from one of the other cameras. Now, I got audio on this. I got the whole conversation. You know, he said, I just can't believe, oh, it, 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 these ones that are 25, 30 years old, they're firing on all cylinders, aren't they? You know, I had to ship hazmat material out, chemicals. I shipped medical supplies out. Had to be written down in triplicate. And uh, I just can't imagine these, these, these 25, 30-year-olds ever being able to do anything. But hold on, guys. Okay, guys. Now, let's see if we can do this. Now, can you guys see? I don't have it focused in. Can you see my address up there? Can you see my address? It says 12211. And it says no soliciting too, but can you see that address? I guess we can't, 12211, can't, can't see that. And then he started up this way. And uh, I said, are you an idiot? I said, that's even the wrong house there. Looks like somebody needs to cut some grass here, too. Look. Oh, and I went out there. Independence out there. There's been a mattress. There's a mattress out there for four weeks now being rained on. Interesting. So hold on, guys. Okay, guys. Well, here's a guy here. Let's see if I can bring this in a little bit. Wow. Isn't that something? So hold on. Well, there we go, guys. Well, I guess if I ever get really desperate, I guess I could always go work for Prime, huh? <laughs> I don't think I want to work for Prime. Anyway. Keep your eyes open.
and have a good one out there.